Hello guys, welcome to Cognitive Hub Talent Tutorials. In this video, I am going to explain you guys about how to copy from one directory or one bucket to the and paste it in or move it from one directory to the other directory so using the TS3 copy component in Talent Studio. So now without wasting any time, let's dive into that topic. So here I am going to create a new job here. TS3 copy demo. And here as a first step, I am going to make a connection to the S3 just like how, how I did in the previous uh, previous thing. So S3 connection and I have the access key noted here, access key and secret key. I am going to use that. Similarly, I am going to copy the access key and paste it here in this place. And I am saving it. And now the connection got successful and now what I'm gonna do is so here these are all the sorry so these are all the buckets that I, I have available here in the Venkat static page I have one file one HTML file that is AWS static file HTML and another one is I have a uh, output uh, directory here so in the output directory I have my employment.zip and similarly if you go to the outside in the snowflake learning bucket if you see that I have a JSON, uh, I have a CSV and different files folder. And now what I'm going to do is I want to copy the data from Venkat static page and I want to paste it in the Snowflake learning bucket. So for that, I am going to use TS3 copy component. So if you open this, I'm, uni I'm using the existing connection here. And now it is asking two things. One is the, the what are the source configuration and what is the destination configuration. And for the source configuration, I'm gonna give the Venkat static page as the bucket name and the destination bucket name is Snowflake Learning Bucket. So here comes the scenario. So under which particular component you wanna move that particular file so here the key that I want to move is let me copy this file name in the Venkat I want to copy this file I want to copy this file from S3 to I want to paste it in a snowflake learning bucket hopefully it is not there in the CS oh it is already there Let me open this. Okay, I want to paste it in JSON. So let's copy, and I want to copy it in uh, JSON. Let's see how whether it will work or not. I'm gonna connect these two with the on sub job. Okay, and anyway, at the end, I'm gonna close this connection with TS3 close. That's the common steps that I'm following right from the starting. saving it and now running it so let's see whether it will move from one one place to other or it will throw an error or something let's see so it got connected yeah it is done so let's see whether uh, it moved or not i am refreshing the bucket so first of all i am gonna check whether it is there in Venkat static page or not sorry I'm going to Venkat static page and if you see this and if you refresh this it is there similarly if you go back and if you see the snowflake learning bucket previously we have in the JSON folder previously we have only one folder but now if you open here a small modification needs to be done here so instead of uh, making that as a simple like instead of making that as just uh, JSON slash we need to paste the whatever the file name that you want to store there as well so here uh, i want to copy from copy aws static file.html from Venkat static page and want to paste it in um, paste the same file inside the json folder so this is how i'm going to do that and now i am saving this and now if i run the job so now it's supposed to run okay i mean without any issues and then if I go there 
I need to have this particular file both in uh, Venkat static page as well as in Snowflake learning bucket. So here I have this file and let me check in the Snowflake learning bucket. In the Snowflake learning bucket uh, the folder is JSON and inside that yeah I have this file named as AWS static file.html and if you see the time step 1935 so that is 735 that got just created. So this is how it happens. Oh, let me refresh it to get the latest timestamp. So if you see this, uh, the latest timestamp is 1937 and just now the time got updated to 1938. So this is how uh, the data will get loaded uh, or copied from one directory to the other directory in AWS S3 uh, through the Talent Studio. So that is all for this video guys. Thank you for watching.